Now let me show you how easy it is to fit. Um, I'll, I'll get the water in a moment. What you want to do is to make sure you've got it the right way up. There's a mark on here that says top, and there's not a mark on here which says bottom, so you know that to hold it up that way. Also, there's a V there into which this piece of skin fits. Uncomfortable if you have it upside down, I can assure you. And what you're going to do is you're going to put it in the hot, in the just boiled water for 14 seconds and then get it out. It's going to be a little bit floppy and it's going to be warm, well, hot, but it isn't going to hurt you. So don't feel you're going to get scalded. You're going to scald yourself or don't feel that it's going to be, your mouth's going to be running with ulcers and things like that because it doesn't work like that. This is thermoplastic. It's been tested for years and in fact, this has been around since 1975. So, Having got it from the just boiled water, you put it into your mouth like this. And then, which I can't do now because it's still rigid, you push from the front all the way to the back using your thumb and first finger and press very heavily on it so you get a very tight fit here. This is very important here because that's where the saliva ducts are. If you don't close the flange as tight as it can go, the flanges then lie on the saliva ducts and you'll salivate a lot, which you will find very uncomfortable and which will be, uh, well, it sort of destroys pillows and things like that. So remember to push hard on there. Okay, now I'll get some boiling water. Um, I've just boiled this water. You have to be careful about it. And I'll put the device in now and count one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. <laughs> ah, that's lovely. That's got some nice indent of the teeth in it, which means that when you're wearing it, it'll fit properly. And I've also squeezed in tightly at the sides. And I haven't, which is the most important thing, bitten down on the rims. Some people, when they do this for the first time, they don't really understand how to use it. And they, they push down there or there. And that makes it cockeyed in the mouth. And that means it's actually going to be quite uncomfortable to wear. And that's when you have to send it back and I have to send your replacement until you get it right. Um, so having done that, you then put this into uh, cold water to harden it up and then you cut off this thing here because you don't want that sticking out of your mouth otherwise it sometimes goes up your nose and looks most unpleasant. So, and, then, and then you use the um, back of a, of a hot spoon to smooth it off and then it's done. Use a small man. Bye. <laughs>